Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to this new vlog. This one is a bit different because I had a fairly busy week between work and spending time with my partner, so I didn't really have the time to film myself speaking to the camera, so I'm really sorry if it's a bit boring or repetitive. I hope you will still enjoy it. On Wednesday morning, I got started on my illustration for the April Hop into Spring Challenge. This week's prompt was feeding the ducks. First, I figured out my color palette. It's something that I do very, very rarely and I should definitely do it more often. Figuring out your color palette helps you not ending up with a massive rainbow puke with zero harmony and that's why I had my color theory open in front of me to make sure that I didn't put together colors that wouldn't work. I know some of it instinctively but it's good to have a little reminder from time to time. Doesn't turn. Huh? Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's creepy. On Thursday, my partner and I had a special me day, so we went to the art shop to get me some mini canvases, and then we went thrift shopping. Yeah, way too big. We then went to the cat cafe where I got absolutely blessed by this magnificent cat who decided to just come and sit on my lap for five minutes. It made me so happy. She was so soft and cuddly. Like, look at her. She then got up and went on with her life, as she should. I had a very, very good day, like I did all of my favorite things. It was so, so nice. Where are you? <laughs> On Friday, it was my partner's turn to have his special day, so we went to the Museum of Walloon Life, where we saw really beautiful paintings of different Walloon landscapes, but we also learned facts about everyday life, about the coal industry, the wood industry, the glass industry, uh, fashion even, and we saw beautiful old advertising like amazing so so beautiful it's so cool <laughs> look at that 
that swimsuit. That's a very small corset. <laughs> Maybe it's for a child. Maybe. Like, dude, what the actual fuck? <laughs> That's so. <laughs> Why is there. Skull again. <laughs> yeah, but what's. How is that related to the rest? We then went to a second-hand bookshop before going home and chilling. This section of the video is only 40 seconds and yet it feels like 3 hours. When filming yourself, you're either not natural at all because you're hyper conscious of the fact that you're filming yourself or you completely forget about it and and then you see the footage and you're like oh i forgot that i was filming If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I have a newfound obsession for ducks. I just think they're cool, they're fun, they're, they're really fun to draw. I've painted this canvas in pink ages ago and on Saturday I finally found the motivation to actually do something on it. Then I decided to bake and shenanigans and tomfoolery and accidents ensued. I turned the sound off to save you from my hysterical laughing crying. Back to the gym, baby. You know when you make your eyeliner too big on one side and so you have to make it bigger on the other side but then it's too big so you have to make the other one bigger until it's just like a mess. Well that's what happened with the eyes of this frog. So let me introduce you to Edwin. Um, he's a bit unhinged but we love him anyway. Then I made some mini canvases and it's the end of this short, weird video. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. Please tell me in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, follow, check my Instagram and all that. Bye guys. Love you lots. See you next time. Bye.